in Fusion FX3, you can now drag and drop objects, units, or anything you like into your perspective view. So what I'm going to do in this design is I'm going to put in a, a cupboard and I'm going to put in a bar stool and also a picture. So we'll start with the, the picture. And the first thing that you need to do is you need to change it from whatever view you want into a draft because it's the quickest. Once you've got it in draft, because it starts rendering each time you, you add your object, that's the reason you, you put it in the fastest one. Um, so I'm going to drag and drop my picture. And if I hold down control, it can move up and down. And when I'm happy with it, I'll put it over there. Okay, so once I've, I've done that, and I can add in a, a stool, a bar stool. Let's go down and choose one that I like. Let's take this one, drag and drop that in, bring it out a little bit. And I want to stick it over there. It will start rendering and draft. The next one, if I want to put units in, you'll notice I change it to Fusion QM. And I just type in my unit name. So if I want to take this one, I drag it. And you'll notice it snap automatically onto that, that cupboard. So once I've done that, snap it there. And I can take a draw unit. So that one there, and I can make that 450. And I can drag that in as well. You'll notice as soon as it gets to the side of it, it will snap onto it. And there we go. That's how easy it is to, to drag and drop. And you can now. So if I highlight this unit here, I can drag that around as well, any way I want. And there we go. So once I, I put in my, my auto features, which I'll do now. Okay, there we, we have it. We've added that in. I can now add in. So if I go to advanced graphics and I want to put in, let's say, a kettle. I can add that in and I can drag it any way I like. So I can put it there in the corner. It's just, This feature is a nice way to get get your object so that your, your design is looking nice. Uh, let's go toaster. Let's put it over here. And we can also do flower just to improve that. So I'm, all I'm doing is I'm dragging in into my design, and there we go. Now the last step that you can take is you can now go into, instead of having it on draft, you click it on preview so you can see what it looks like. And there we have our, our brand new design. It looks really nice after we've dragged in dropped in units and in appliances and just little features to to make it look good thank you for watching this this new videos feature